Hi everybody, happy Monday. It is Monday, March 12th. And today is the 11th day after our transfer. And I know a lot of you are, have been praying and have been waiting to hear the news, if we're pregnant, if we're not pregnant. And for those that follow me on the other social media, you guys probably already know, but for those of you that do not, we are pregnant. We are officially pregnant. Um, today's beta came back at 170, so we could not be any more happier. We could not be any more happy. Sorry, that makes more sense. Um, and yeah, we haven't been wanting to share a lot, but we have been testing and doing betas since day four, but we really didn't want to say anything until we finally got an official beta, and then we knew for sure. So, I'm going to share with you guys the pregnancy test progression and what the beta was on this certain day that the test was taken. And I can't believe we made it, you guys. We made it. We made it. We made it. We're pregnant. Now we just have to, like, everything is so fragile. We just have to wait. <laughs> we have to hope that everything continues on. The numbers keep doubling. That the ultrasound shows that there is a sack. And, yeah. We're definitely not out of the woods, but this is the first step, you guys. This is the first step. This is what we've been praying for. This is what we've been wanting for so long. And it's here it's like i almost need to like pinch myself because it's hard to even believe that like this is our lives like we're actually like this is our life like there's a positive pregnancy test and it's our pregnancy test well not our pregnancy test but our baby <laughs> and it's just i can't my mind is like completely completely blown i'm just i can't even believe that it happened like i can't even before we had, you know, did IVF, I just always suspected like the first transfer just wouldn't work. And so yeah, this is just completely mind blowing. Um, definitely our prayers were answered and now we can just hope and pray that baby continues to grow and is healthy and my sister-in-law is healthy and doesn't get sick and you know isn't too tired and all of the all of the good things that can happen when you're pregnant so let's hope that she doesn't get sick let's hope that she's not that tired and I just can't even believe it I can't even believe it like we've started like discussing like how crazy it's gonna be having another baby because our youngest is gonna be six next month so crazy so crazy I can't even um so yeah and yeah I can't it's just I can't even believe it thank you guys so much for all your prayers all your thoughts all your good vibes everything all your encouraging comments along the way I know that it's been a really long long journey um it's been a long journey for us too um we've been at this for almost five years now maybe yeah just right at five years now because maybe five and a half this was right after Mason was born um we're finally here and I, I just can't even so I'm going to show you the line progression right now Please just keep us in your thoughts and in your prayers and um, I'm gonna try to update you guys the more that we know hopefully we'll have an ultrasound in the next like two weeks so that maybe we can see the heartbeat um, 
maybe a gender reveal a couple more weeks down the road. It's just just keep it going you guys and I'm gonna zip it up for tonight and thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you guys for all your prayers and thoughts again and we love you and we'll see you guys later don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you're super excited that we're pregnant don't forget to hit that subscribe button below if you want to follow this crazy journey <sighs> yeah and I'll see you guys Hopefully a little bit later. Bye!